Hey YouTube, what's going on? Junior here, back again with another reaction video, back again with another viewer request, back again for a brand new installment of Friday Filth, my favorite series. What about yours? As I'm sure all of you have guessed, if you're at all keeping up with any news regarding my life, I'm still away on a business trip. That's right, I pre-recorded this video just so I could have something to release in the middle of the week long absence and I thought that Friday filth is a good midpoint it's a good uh, constant and it's something that I enjoy so even though I'm recording this video in advance and I have to do extra work hopefully I'll still enjoy it because it's a fun series and I get to listen to pretty pretty cool music that's the story behind what's going on right now of course episode of Friday filth as always sponsored by RuneGate studio please go subscribe here once I get back from my business trip I want to see this this uh, this channel just blowing up. The song we're doing today, whoa, holy artifacts. The song we're doing today is Rubber Johnny by Aphex Twin. Uh, I've gotten a, quite a few suggestions for this song. So that's what I thought we would do. It's short, it's sweet, and apparently it's quite uh, unnerving. As requested by first names, last names, Paranku. Oh, let's, oh, it's the two dashes, Budanku, Budanku. <laughs> Blank. I thought it was the I thought it was the dot. Carlos de Aureli Aureli and generic man. Thanks to all of you who suggested this song. Of course, everybody following their example. Leave your suggestions in the comments down below. And the next video could be yours. And that's pretty cool. You like Friday Filth? I like Friday Filth. Contribute to future episodes of it. I've got the music video here, which I think is the main attraction. As a lot of people noted in the last Apex Twin video, Chris Cunningham is the visual genius behind their music videos apparently so props to that dude he even says rubber johnny by chris cunningham and aphex twin so give him props for props is due and i guess we'll just have to see if we can survive this experience of course if i didn't explain this before friday filth is the weekly series i do where i go out and attempt to find the most vile disgusting abrasive weird disturbing music humanly possible and see if i can withstand it we haven't come across anything too extreme yet but we're still warming up we're still in the early stages of the series so we're just we're still feeling it out i've got some pretty gnarly stuff incoming but i thought for this week something quick and fast i've got a meeting i gotta get to in 20 minutes so we can't spend all day on this let's just jump right into it now how are you feeling Dad. You feeling okay? You feel well? Can I get you something? Okay. You want a glass of water? This is like the SCP. <laughs> We're not really getting anywhere, are we, at the moment? Are you seeing something? Is there something you see over there? What do you see there, Johnny? Yeah. What's this about Mama? Is this your mother? It's okay, it's a baby. What's the matter? Do you want Mama to come in? <coughs> Don't breathe like that. It'll make you feel really strange. I'm with you and nothing's going to happen to you. Just calm down now. Just try to relax. Try and keep calm. Don't tense up. Just relax. I think you're getting a bit stressed out at the moment. Whoa. Would you mind if I gave you an injection or something like that to make you calm? Should we try doing that? It won't hurt you at all. Just like a little bee sting. And then you'll be calm. Okay. <laughs> So these lyrics that I have are actually just this monologue, or this dialogue rather, between uh, Rubber Johnny and it seems like some sort of doctor or caretaker or something who's taking care of this weird deformed baby or alien or mutant or something uh, who's starting to freak out. They, there's a couple of those like stock noise smacking sounds which kind of uh, jolted me out of the immersion a little bit. But overall, a very creepy vibe. Very, uh, very weird. I'm interested to see where this goes. Does the music start now? Okay. Oh, I thought that was. Oh, okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh no! I just see. I just think it's music because I'm like so used to weird industrial stuff. It just keeps being. So this is a dog now. Wait, was Rubber Johnny a dog the whole time? 
I mean, chihuahuas do look a little freaky, not gonna lie. Oh no, okay, there he is. big this guy's head is that's where the intelligence in intelligent dance music comes in big brain music right here boys this is this is the average listener of Aphex Twin right here <laughs> A taste of the actual musical components of this song very glitchy very weird very industrial too like they're the way the video is shot it looks like you know they're making it look like a lot of these sounds are coming from different mechanics different like components in the video like these wheelchair clicking and lights and stuff like that along with a bunch of other weird poppy stuff bouncing around everywhere it's very it's very bouncy it's very uh off kilter and, and kind of cool i mean the video stopped being disturbing and kind of went into this weird, uh, like kind of darkly funny territory with this, <laughs> this wheelchair bound rubber Johnny flailing and dancing around. So I don't know, pretty cool though. Pretty, pretty cool so far. His face getting smashed into the glass over and over again. I'm just, I do have to say the editing was pretty crazy. Like, that must have taken quite a while. Every little blip, click, bounce had a different cut and something weird going on. It was all visually very interesting. Yeah, I mean, hmm. Hmm. Okay, so that was Robert Johnny by Aphex Twin. Featuring the visual 
mastery of Chris Cunningham. Huh. Overall, yeah, it was an interesting song. It was kind of a fun thing you could kind of groove and dance around to. Pretty chaotic. Pretty weird. The visuals were somewhat unsettling, especially at the beginning and near the end when he's kind of getting his face smashed into the glass like over and over again. Like he's getting destroyed, rearranged, put back together, and, and uh, I guess forced to go through that experience again and again. Trying to take some meaning of the lyrics here, or not really lyrics, because it's just, it's just this dialogue between this Robert Johnny, who I thought was kind of like a baby at first, but it seems to be kind of like this mentally stunted, weird, mutant thing in a wheelchair. Uh, and some sort of doctor, scientist maybe? who is, you know, trying to talk to him and injects him with some sort of thing that to uh, supposedly calm him down. And then there's somebody else. They so open the door and look at him after after he's been freaking out for a while. And it's like, what did you do to him? Like, he's being he's being crazy. There's a probably a, a myriad of different meanings you could pull from that regarding things about control, experimentation, abuse of power, ah, or just, you know, taking it literally as, as some sort of weird mutant thing or something, you know? Just... There's not, no really clear cut and dry thing. I, don't, I think trying to pull a meaning out of it is not really the point of the song. I think, you know, for things, stuff like this, you try to have, you just have to kind of sit back, relax, enjoy the music, enjoy the visuals for how weird they are. And when you do that, it definitely is enjoyable. It's definitely a very entertaining video. It wasn't really that uh, unsettling, scary, disturbing or whatever, just because I found it kind of funny, uh, just in the middle bits. But I can see where, where where people would think it's kind of off-putting. Overall, a good song. I did enjoy the very glitchy beat, how intelligent this music has made me. I hope someday I'll end up like Rubber Johnny with such a massive IQ. It, it, in its own strange way, it was kind of catchy. Would I listen to the song again? Perhaps just kind of in the background while I'm doing other things, just to kind of have on his music, because it is enjoyable. There's nothing in it that particularly stands out to me. Just an interesting experience that I'm glad that I went through. I'm okay with that. Was it a good song? Yes. Was it Friday Filth material? Hmm. The video certainly makes a case for it, but I don't think it was, I, I think we can still go further, guys. I think we can dive deeper into the disturbing, into the macabre, into the unknowable. I think there's more out there. But of course, that'll be it for me today, guys. This will be my last video until I get back from business, from my business trip. So I hope you had a great time. I hope y'all are having a great time. And I hope I'm having a great time on my trip too. I, I'm leaving tomorrow, so we'll see how it goes. Should be fun. But either way, if you like the video, make sure to like it. If you like the channel, make sure to subscribe. Of course, everybody have a great day, a great weekend, and I'll see you someday soon. Don't unsubscribe. You'll hurt my feelings. Bye.